Me? Gungaga. Me. Troy. Good evening. I'm here. Uh, it is just after midnight, Wednesday slash Thursday. Um, no, no bug tonight. No bug. That was kind of a one night thing. I don't know. Maybe I'll bring it back. I don't know. Probably not this week though. We'll see. Um, tonight we've got more Metroid, and tonight might be the end. I'm not sure. We've only got two upgrades and two artifacts left to find. So this might be the last part. But I also want to get all the upgrade. I also want to get all the all the like missiles and stuff. I know where the last tank is. We saw it. So I just need to get. I need to find the rest of the power bombs and the rest of the uh, missile upgrades. And uh, yeah, I don't know if you can hear it, but uh, it's it's been pretty fucking hot today. Uh, so hot that we've bro broken out the fans and the air conditioning at home. In fact, I don't have that fan pointing at me. I'm using the air conditioner in fan mode, so it's not too loud. But yeah, April 13th, 413, and we're doing that. It's 413, isn't that a significant date for something? I can't remember. I feel like I've done voices in something that has a very significant uh, connection. To the, day, to the date of uh, 413. What? That'll fine now. Anyway, Talon Overworld. We're 78% complete with the uh, item collection. We need one more tank. We're 16 hours in. Difficulty normal. We have not looked at the gallery at all. Uh, if I don't finish this tonight, I don't know what I'm going to do regarding it because I don't want to do, like, just this tomorrow if there's not enough for two whole streams, but I also don't want to start anything else tomorrow. I want to wait until then. I don't know. Maybe I'll go and do Kirby. I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure Kirby's what I'm going to be doing most of next week, like going back, finishing Magalore uh, epilogue, and then doing extra mode in the true arena. I'm just, I just, the problem is like, I just don't want to go through the whole main story again, but I'm sure it'll be quicker because I'm not constantly stopping to do things. So, I have, I keep going the wrong way, so I need two more artifacts. Molten Lake lies in the tunnels of Magmore, shadow of the column at the lake center, and that I can't do yet. And then I have to forge a path through a tunnel of great poison in the mines, which I can't do yet. Both of those in involve stepping in damaging areas, so i will put those on hold for now. We do have... Uh, our heading here, though. That was weird. Is my, is my left stick drif drifting now? Great. We do have our heading. We have to go down to the phase on mines. Uh, we have to make our way to the question mark room. Which I believe we need to go this way to get into, because the other way. Yeah, this way. The, the hint is gone. That's kind of weird. Yeah, we tried going this way and it won't let us in. Like, there's a gate, a security gate from the other side. So, what we have to do is we have to go up here, down this tunnel, and then through. And I think we've. We went up here. This is where the flame, the plasma beam upgrade was. So, let's see. The quickest way to get to that spot would be. To get there from Magmore Cavern south. Because then we go up. We'll be here, and then we just gotta go around. Actually, no, it doesn't really matter. They both kind of drop you off at the same point. Like, this this room's kind of just the center room for that. So we could go, uh... We could go through Talon Overworld south as well. Where is that portal? We have to head, all, head over to the uh, Great Tree Hall, which is... Oh, we have to go to the pirate ship to get there. Uh, is there any... Did I miss any anything in there? I don't think I did. I don't 
don't know. There's probably power-ups I missed in there. Honestly, getting over there is probably a pain in the ass. We should probably just go the other way. Get getting around in this game is not super great. Because there's not a lot of- there's, there's no, like, central hub. Like, Talon Overworld is the closest part to a central hub, but it's not really one. Like, to get to Phazon Mines from here, I still have to travel quite a far distance. Alright, well, let's go to Magmore Cavern South. Uh, that would be... East. Alright, I guess getting down to Magmore Caverns is the first step. I'm really curious, is there a way to- is there gonna be a way to see, like, things on the map that I haven't collected? Because it's gonna be very confusing trying to find my way around. I have to, like, revisit every single room to see if there's, like, an upgrade I missed or something. It feels like a very weird misstep in an otherwise, like, excellently designed game. And then again, I just criticized the lack of a, uh, of a central hub. I mean, you know what, I guess I can't really criticize that, because that's kind of just how Metroid's always been. I've been spoiled by, like, Castlevania, which usually has a teleporter. Stuff like that. Today was, uh, it was a day. Like I said, it's been very hot. I didn't even realize it was until the end of the day, but it is, uh, it is extremely hot outside for, for April. Uh, yeah, this is where I think the artifact is, because there's a spot over here that you just can't reach right now. Fendrana Drifts. Phazon Mines, okay. So we want to go through the lava, lava sea over here. And the thing is, like, you can't really see what's over here. Actually, no, I don't think it's here. Maybe not. Oh, I, never mind. I kept thinking there would be something hidden over here, but it doesn't look like it. Maybe there's, um, maybe there's, like, an upgrade or something hidden here somewhere. Like, it's around this corner that I can't... No, maybe not. Maybe there's nothing here. Maybe I'm just imagining shit. I'm trying to learn to, like, not trust anything here, and to check the, uh, x-ray visor on, like, every possible spot. <laughs> so 
So I already went up there, and there's nothing over... Th that's just a puzzle to get the plasma rifle. Rifle. Beam. I don't know. I knew I was... I knew I was saying it wrong as it was coming out of my mouth, and I'm like, wait a minute, what am I saying? What... This isn't... This ain't Halo. This area I've missed because I went through all these tunnels already and they were just to unlock the uh an upgrade that I already had that I already have rather that's where I came in oh that's the monsters down there that's making those noises them's noises also if my volume is a little weird uh, I adjusted. I've been doing. I've been doing audition. Oh, well, I've been doing auditions the last few days, so um, my volume has been adjusted a lot. Again, I, I'm thinking of maybe switching out how I have my setup here. Because if I get if I get like a portable booth to make up for not being able to like not afford, but like not being able to fit a real booth in my house, because I really don't have the room here for it. Um, I'm thinking of moving like all the equipment I'm using to that. So like the the Scarlet Focusrite, the the XLR mic, um, I'm thinking of moving them to like that specifically, and then using like a cheap laptop just to record stuff. The laptop doesn't matter as long as it can handle the uh, programs I'm using to record and mix. It's fine. And then what I'm thinking of doing is maybe just getting like you know like a gamer headset, which I actually I have one because my headset for work broke a while ago, and they sent me just like a nice pair of JBLs. I don't know if they're going to be really good for streaming. But I might have to check that out and see if it works. The problem is it uses the audio jack, and I don't think my computer just has a standard audio jack in it. So I'm not sure. I doubt this is blow up a bull, but I'm gonna try. No. So, I don't know, I might give that a shot at some point. I'll have to see. Like, the thing is, my mic and my headset right now are connected to my, uh, my Scarlet Solo. Via a, uh, an adapter, a jack adapter, and a, and, well, the XLR mic need, just needs a preamp to go through. Actually, is it, is it really, is it a preamp? I, I actually don't, didn't look that up if the audio interface is technically a preamp. Like, is it semantics, or am I actually... Oh god, I forgot about this. It's stupid. freeze enemies. Nope, plasma. Obviously it doesn't kill them, it just kind of stuns them and gets them on the ground. Here, I need to go up 
through the white door, over to where the safe point is, and then head to the left. one behind me. I don't know where that thing spawned from. Space pirates reproduce. Like they're clear. I think they're cultiv. I mean, like serious question. I think they're cultivated. Cause that's what it seems like. Given that they're kind of grown in tubes. Okay, we already blew the gas out of this room. So I could get in there and get the upgrade. There's anything else I'm missing here? I was gonna say, I think, did I not go through that white room? I did. It's just blending in with everything else. This was part of the run from hell from a few days ago. That whooshing noise makes me think of uh, Zero Escape. There's a, uh, a song in Zero Escape that uses kind of like a, a whooshing, like, arrow noise. Like, Foo! Like someone shooting an arrow really quickly. Which is generally how arrows are shot. blow that thing up. Free him. Actually, no, it's the room where the other one broke through. Yeah. break them. I'm sure one of them will come out at me, since you have to... Like, the, this game's clever, because you have to go through this room to get to... Actually, no, wait, never mind. Maybe not. Maybe I don't have to go through... Well, it'll probably force me through this room at, at some point. Knowing my luck. And then those two will break out, and I'll have to fight them.
of course it's a big one. Phase on readings and yeah, no, we know where it is. We know where it is. Wow, that's simple, huh? This is this looks from what I could tell, this is like the last stretch of the of new areas. This 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 ride up to this next upgrade down here that we're being told to get. Cause I don't think there's any more big areas on the map, and it doesn't look like there's anything on the map other than like areas I've already been to. Unless there's like hidden rooms that I can't see. Safe point behind this room. Still kill them. Or not. They, they actually just don't work. <laughs> I swore I just saw something. This room, which originally led to a dead end, probably has something in it now that I can uh, use the uh, x-ray visor.
That uh, didn't really work, huh? <laughs> yep, I had a feeling there was invis invincible platforms here. Oh, you can also see them with the heat visor because you could see the little like jets underneath them. Oh, that's hurting me. came from here. Okay, so that's where I approached from. Oh, it does read that as high. It counts as radiation. Interesting. Magnesium wall within is unstable. Okay. Let's need a power bomb for that. Oh, alright, so I have to go up that way. I have to utilize. Poison tree. Oh, wait, no, there's a platform right here. Okay, there's that over there. And there's that right there. I see a door up there. Brief moment where you get light is so nice. Okay. So we have access to over here, which I had seen before, but we couldn't really make heads nor tails of.
Oh, there's a power up up there. Okay. We couldn't make Sonic nor Tails of it. Okay, let's uh, let's move on here. Up there, up there, over here. Give me that missile. Delicious missiles. I don't think there's anything else up here. I think there was just the, the missile. Magnetic road track system. Yep, just like playing theater rhythm. Two for one on that. Nice. All right, scanning. Nothing. This room seems kind of small. Yes, it is. Elevator access. B. So it looks like there'd be something up there, but there probably isn't. That looks like it would be something. That looks suspicious. We can't scan it, so it probably isn't. Access to phase on mines, level 3 granted. Please step into the hologram. Transport active. I keep feeling like one of these areas is gonna have, like, something as I'm going down it that I could collect. Shit. Well, that's the second time I've done that. Like, I move after it lands at the bottom and it automatically triggers it to go back up. Uh, whatever. Here and think about what I've done for a minute. Well, here we are. This is essentially what's the final stretch, though. I'm sure, we'll have more to do afterwards. That's nice. Nice. Ah, that's rude, though. Like you could, you could just not do that. That's that's also an option. Take a big steppy. Okay. Like, I follow up every sentence I say with okay. Like, I'm embarrassed to say it, and I don't know why. 
not like I'm. It's not like anything I'm saying is is worse than what 99% of people on Twitch talk about. Get those mushrooms. Uh, you know, it's probably just if you fall down there. I was gonna say those mushrooms over there look kind of interesting. That's a super Metroid. Metroid Super. Hunter Troid. Cold base of stack, uh, stacks. Cold base of stacks are still quite subjective. Shebec shebective. Wow, it was alive for a second, and then it just kind of gave up. Shatter. I like, um, listen. I like the squish as Samus walks across these mushrooms. They're very squishy. Okay, we Marioing now. I was using plasma on the small Metroids. I should have been using the ice beam the whole time. Why didn't I know that? I've played every side-scrolling Metroid. They're always weak to ice. I swear, sometimes my brain it don't it don't work too good. It won't it won't work too good. I've got the spicy neurons, and sometimes they don't they don't they don't neuron pro properly. They they make me a real neuron, noron, moron. My favorite character in uh, Fuga Melodies of Steel, Steel, Boron. Speaking of Melodies of Steel, two soon, 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 soon. Wednesday, May eleventh. Comes out. No, May eleventh is Thursday. Yeah. I will not be here. And also, Tears of the Kingdom comes out literally the next day. So it's like ah. Fuga, it's so unfortunate. It sucks too, because no one ever covered no one covers those games. They don't because CyberConnect 2 is making them and developing them and publishing them on their own. Which is why there's no physical edition, because it's just too expensive. And it's just like they can't really pay for like advertising. It's just too much. Alright, I'm gonna purposely take a dive down here and see if there's anything collectible. Give me Crystal Chronicles vibes. Big mushrooms. Blue, like, ambience. This weird, like, dinging noise in the music. If you could really call this music. That was a nice, um, not gonna work type situation there. The, the grapple beam's a little finicky, and I feel I should have made that. Like, there was no reason why I shouldn't have. Shoulders 
getting a little pained here. I'm going to readjust my arms a bit. I'm assuming I have to be on that shroom at the very end. Oh, I have to jump to that one, probably. I think I was skipping one. Or no. I was just trying to reach it from an awkward angle, that's why. It's probably gonna be a fight room. Phazon Mining Tunnel. Yeah, that room. That's a cylinder. C cylinders, of, cylinders are usually bad news. Cylinder of Doom. Bendesium. High levels of Bendesium present. Bendoverium. Oh, wait. Is this a sideways room? Oh, no. I think it's a circular puzzle room. That's probably what it's going to be. I could just tell by the way it's curving. So there's probably something in here that I won't be able to see because no visor. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, all right. I see what's happening here. Oh, okay. Never mind. That disintegrates immediately. Can I just roll past this all? Yeah, I don't think you could... I don't think you could step on that for, like, even a second. Oh, okay. You could charge across it. I don't think there's any secrets up here, though. Yeah. That looks like there's a secret down there, but I probably don't want to, uh... Probably don't want to go down there. Yeah, that bleeds down lower into the tunnel. I'm sure that when I get the last suit upgrade, which I'm assuming is Phazon suit, it'll let me walk through... Oh, th th there's the uh, artifact! So I have to go to there. Vader's mind the depths to forge a path through a tunnel of the great poison. Phase on mining tunnel. Alright. Checks out. This or this is gonna end up being a well, that that's an upgrade room. I could just tell by the way that looks. That's probably the final upgrade, because this is probably an upgrade too. So if I had to guess, this is going to be a save room over here, or a missile room. That was another Retroid. I was like, what is that? It's it's just a shroom. It's a tiny shroom. Like the kind you get in Pokemon that you could sell for like 500 Poke Dollars.
excellent Foley design in this game. head that way first, up to that door. I don't really know where to go from here, though. I didn't land on that, did I? Nope. Of course not. Not gonna lie, I don't like how hard it is to see here. Like, I have to use a special visor, or I'm, I'm not gonna just, just not gonna be able to progress. get over to any of those three. Okay, I'm on the shroom. Now I could swing over there pretty easily. room. Or map room. Wait, is it a map? No, this is a missile room. Yeah. Let's say, do I need a map? I have a map. I think it treats that as like an upgrade. Okay. There's a... Uh, possibly something hidden in here. Doesn't fully reload your bombs, though. That's only the second missile refill room I've seen. Hmm. I feel like these two mushrooms are here for a reason, and I can't figure out why. Maybe not. Maybe we're just there for there, there to be there. They're just there for ambience. Visible lightning bursts now. How? Oh, yeah, just there's just invisible enemies now. That's cool.
Metroid Quarantine B. Uh, this is gonna be a a room, huh? That might be uh that might be a save room actually. This just looks like an upgrade room because this is the this looks like the same layout that other upgrades have been in. I'm gonna crack open a cold one here, like an actual cold one because, well, I mean it's still juice, but it's cold juice because man, it is not cold in this room. Weather's been going nuts so lately. I mentioned this before, but when I went down to Atlanta last year, oh, my phone has a notification on the calendar. I'm like, what the fuck? Um, I forgot that uh, I booked tickets to see the Mario movie this weekend with Nessie, so we're gonna go see it uh, Saturday afternoon, and then next weekend we're gonna go see Dungeons and Dragons, which uh. Very much looking forward to. I'm looking forward to both of them. I've heard good things about both. Well, I've seen good things about the Dungeons & Dragons movie. Ma namely that there's a Kenku in it. And it's all practical effects and it looks really cool. Hey. Good evening. You're here just in time for mushrooms. Oh, no. What are those? Plasma? Oh, no, plasma's not real. I keep thinking plasma's electricity, it's not. Yes, I know. It's literally right there. You marked it a million times. This is the only spot left on the map I have not gone to. <laughs> I think that I'm actually, like, there's no more else to go after this, so we've gone to every room possible. Unless there's more rooms that are hidden off the map. I'm assuming all the Metroids are in the square part at the end. Square. No. <laughs> Beat you to it, yeah. We're both very Vinny-pilled. Uh, okay, can I jump to that, or should I... Use that. Oh, that's when I get over there. Okay. Security override control engaged. Access granted. Probably should have waited until I got over there to do that. Yeah. Probably should have. swing into with this. I can't see where to go. Oh, there's a platform over there. Okay. Ah, 
I'll be honest, the plasma beam guys, no, the ice beam guys are the easiest, because you could literally just freeze them. Really funny that they're weak to the to your own weapon, their own weapons. I didn't scan that uh, force field. I hope that was nothing lore related. Streams. Oh, B uh, Ghostbusters was on today on AMC. I didn't watch it, but uh, I saw it was on. They were airing both of them today. One and two. It's both of them, because we all know there's only two of them, ever. We were watching uh, We were watching Beetlejuice while we were eating dinner tonight, and that's a, it's a fun dinner movie. Certainly a fun dinner movie. Love the part where Beetlejuice grabs the cockroach and eats it. That's something appetizing to watch while I'm trying to eat. I don't think I've ever seen that movie all the way through. Ever. Days suggest that Omega Pirate lifespans are critically low. High levels of phase on exposure are causing rapid cell degeneration in all test subjects. No subject lived longer than two deca cycles in our simulation. Their lifespans must be increased to be cost effective. Omega Pirate absorption system test results are in. Field tests indicate that the system is very effective against beam weaponry. We are alarmed at the field's inability to handle missile attacks, however. Science team is working around the clock to correct this critical design flaw. The Omega Pirates cannot afford such a weakness in battle. Log 11.369.4. As we continue to observe de the development of Project Helix's elite pirates, it becomes increasingly obvious that these warriors will usher in a new era of space pirate dominance. They are incredibly resistant to damage, and their ability to transport and wield so many weapons at once makes them the ideal mainstays of our ground forces. Though they are not as quick as typical pirates, it makes little difference. With a platoon of elite pirates and the vanguard of an army of normal and flying pirates, we will have a near-indestructible backbone that should turn the tide in any engagement. Someone watched Robert, Roger Rabbit? No, I have not. Never watched Robert Rabbit. Roger, Robert Rabbit? Roger Rabbit. Never seen uh, Edward Scissorhands. I know that's another one people have, have gotten on my case about not watching. It's a save room. Someday I'll sit down and watch them. Someday, just not right now. I figured this was going to have to... Like, it was either going to be an upgrade or a save room. But that begs the question of where the last uh, upgrade is then. Maybe there's another area. Oh, you know what? That's probably it. Once I get all the artifacts, there's probably a new area to go to. Like a final, like a last dungeon type type deal. Numerous fractures present in this cordite shaft. Uh, is that, that's super missile, right? Yep. All right, two more rooms to go. Health alert. Phase on radiation warning still in effect. Do not enter a phase on processing area without level 8 radiation gear. Prolonged exposure is 100% fatal. Ooh, like Snowgrave. Phase on processing efficiency at maximum. Production at 187% and rising. I said that specifically because I knew you'd react. You'd react to that. <laughs> yep, that's exactly the reaction I expected. Man, I haven't played Smash in a while. I still, I still have to finish the Spirit mode playthrough I was doing because I fought every spirit up to the Minecraft DLC and I never did uh I don't think I ever did Sephiroth uh Pyra and Mithra and, and Sora's and, and Kazuya's spirits on stream this is the elite quarters access good Bro, your aim sucks. You couldn't hit the broadside of a barn. Well, 
look at that. What a neat little puzzle. for battle. Whoa, what the fuck is all this? The fuck's happening here? Morphology, Omega Pirate, the most powerful of the elite pirate forces. Omega Pirates can become invisible to normal sight. It is vulnerable when cloaked as all energy is drawn from defense systems. By exposing itself to Phazon, it can regenerate, damage tissues and organs. Considered the pinnacle of elite pirate program, Consider the pinnacle of the elite pirate program. This enemy should be handled with extreme caution and maximum firepower. Platform active. I'm guessing that's where it refills itself. We'll just uh, scoot over here and ignore it. Some sort of data disk. It sounded like the music started coming out of like a speaker in the room. Like I'm in an abandoned mall or some shit. It's a heckin' shonker of a pirate. The, this is only like the third boss I've fought in this game that has like its own health bar. I don't think I've fought any other boss. Like this, this, the sun room enemy, and the, the thing at the very beginning of the game in, in the frigate. I think the super missile still technically, uh, like, energy-based. Like, the normal missiles don't bounce off the thing, but... I guess they don't want you to use super missiles because they really need you to use regular missiles in this fight. something wrong? I'm gonna 
a lot to keep track of in this fight. They didn't need to throw random space pirates in here, too, to make things harder. Also, I love how no matter when I jump for that move, I get hit by it. There we go. There's three of them now, cool. Oh, it's back to normal. Shit. This is a lot to keep track of. Yeah, this is a fuckload to keep track of here. Oh, good, he kills them. Alright, perfect. He kills them when he does the electrical thing. Well, he tries to. I can't shoot him up. God. I gotta say, for a game that has no bosses, they really ratchet up the boss difficulty. <laughs> I have enough health to really just stand here and tank this, though. Shit, man. I'm a little, like, uh, a little, like, kind of not happy here. This fight's a little more difficult than it should be. Like, why Why do I have to... See, I can't even kill them because he's absorbing all the shots. My energy's low, I'm dead. I'm just gonna give up. Like, I'm a little... I'm a little, like... Face on mine. This, this area sucks. This is like the only area I've died in, and I've died three times. I just don't understand why I have to juggle enemies on top of all this. Like, it's a lot to deal with. This wasn't like this before.
Why is this room dark now? It was dark the first time I came through it. Bypass unit encased in frigidite shell. So there's extreme heat could clear the unit and restore function. And read that the first time. That's an elevator. That's what that thing is. Not dodge to the side. to blow half in one go. enemies that are lying around. Okay, thank you. Get too close or you get hit. Can't 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 step in the pit or you get hit. Oh also deal with these three enemies shooting at you while you're fighting this thing. He may kill them, but he may not. Completely up to chance. You get a bit of time at the beginning when these enemies show up to, to take them out. A 
not a lot. Come on, come on, respawn, respawn. One more. There we go. Melts into goo. It's like the end of Evangelion. That fight was alright. It, it had a bit too much going on with it. Oh! New suit, hell yeah. New suit, who dis? I figured it was going to be the Phazon suit. I wonder if I get the Phazon beam. Your suit has been infused with pure Phazon. This corrupt corruption... This corruption prevents damage from Phazon radiation. Viral corruption of the power suit has some beneficial side effects. The suit is not resistant to the effects of Phazon. may not be invulnerable to certain extremely potent forms of Phazon, however. In addition to Phazon, resistance to corruption has dramatically increased my defense shielding levels. Okay, so she, she won't take damage. Love well, how it's like, oh, it's not an upgrade. You're infected. You, you stepped in that Phazon. You really stepped in it now. Why are these, like, orange? Why are some of them orange? Like, I get that my equipped one is out. Oh, I have the phase on. I got both upgrades. Okay. Bow corruption of the power suit has altered my arm cannon as well. It is now capable of firing the powerful phase on beam. Phase on beam appears to trigger the presence of high concentration of phase on. Regular arm cannon functions return to normal when phase on is not present. Charge beam does not function when the phase on beam is active. Cool. No extra visor. No more. Okay, so that's all the upgrades. So I'm fully upgraded. It's like, how do I... If I step in the phase on? No. I'm guessing I'll get a tutorial on how the phase on beam works. There's probably like a very specific trigger I have to stand on. Leads back to where I was. This feels like there'd be something here, but I guess not. It's pronounced Fazan, dumbass. Ugh. You're not even a real Metroid fan. Yes, that's what I wanted. A final E tank.
on this. Whoa! Did I get an attack increase? Okay, well now I can go there. I still have to figure out where the, uh, the lava pillar is. But I should probably go back the way I came, because that'll get me to the, uh... That'll get me the, uh artifact that I missed, because I saw where it was. Fission Metroid. Metroid with the ability to split into two forms. The Fission Metroid is a mutant, capable of splitting in two. This creature endows the new creatures with invulnerability most weaponry. This effect is unstable, resulting in weakness to a type of weapon fire. The vulnerability appears to be random due to the chaotic nature of Phazon mutation. Ugh. Oh, I see. They're colored. They're color-coded. able to perform immediate mitosis. Yeah, that's cool. Don't think I'll be sticking around to fight you, though. Wow, this, uh... Yeah, we got a bot, and the bot is very, uh, being very aggressive. We timed it out, thankfully. That's a, that's a good thumbnail right there. Actually, wait, no, I have to take a screenshot. I'm going bald. What, why isn't it working? There we go. No one ever expects you to go bald. Samus will never be balling. And then she turns into the morph ball on the guy eating the cereal. Uh, this is a spit take. didn't save me getting this. Oh, cool. These are just here now. Game knew I was coming back this way. That's literally right there. To be honest, I think I could have powered through this with max health, but it's a good thing I waited. You 
son of a bitch. There's still 5% of log entries left and 18% of items. I've gotten all the research. Probably missing some creatures, I'm guessing. Towards the end. Fission yeah, I'm missing an Oh, okay. Yeah, there's one more type of Metroid. And then down here are the bosses with the Omega Pirate being the Okay. So I haven't missed any creatures. Haven't missed any research items. Got all but the one artifact. Still missing a Chozo lore, which I'm assuming we'll get at the end, because it's at the it's in the last area probably. Pirate data though. Uh we missed that. So we missed one pirate data. I'll probably look up where that is actually, just so I don't miss it. All Chozo lore locations. I'm not gonna look up specifics, I just wanna see if it's like if I have it yet or not. Wrong wrong section. So it's right below shapeless. What is this? What is- this is not a guide. This is not a guide. Chozo Ruins Magma Pool. Magma Pool. So it's okay. I must have missed it because it's in Chozo Ruins. Magma Pool is uh, at the beginning, isn't it? Yeah, Mag. So there's a lore here I haven't gotten. Okay, I gotta go back there. Good thing I looked that up. There's one lore and then one pirate. Pirate data. Pirate data. Yeah, pirate. The only pirate data I'm missing is is. The one after Metroid Studies. I don't actually want the logbooks, I just want the entry location. Vendrana Drift's Research Lab Hydra- oh god. Really have to go all the way back there. Ugh. Where is that? Ah, oh, really? It's in the first room? How did I miss that? So there's a lore in there I haven't gotten. I have to go back for that one. Okay, so we know where to go to get those. The only thing we don't know is where the remaining upgrades are. The remaining missiles and power bombs. And also the artifact, and to figure out what that is. Is that something up here? No. Come on. Samus will never be balling. I, I, I made that joke right. Why am I saying that again? literally turns into a ball. <laughs> Just out of curiosity. Nope, there's nothing there. Back. Oh god, there's fissions here now, too. It's 
It's like that movie Sausage Party, except it's a Metroid party, and it's actually fun, unlike Sausage Party. Ow. Wow, they hit you so hard they, like, knock your chin up. Follow me through rooms. Missile under there. Ah. Why there's no lava suit in this game? Like that's kind of a staple of Metroid. Well, I guess Metroid One. Getting the the suit that's resistant to lava. That's that's not in this game. You're not. You don't get that lava resistance. Speaking of, uh, I am looking forward. I haven't. I don't think I've ever mentioned this on stream, which is something I say a lot, and I probably I'm usually wrong. Um, shit. I'm actually. I am in fact looking forward to Yacht Club Games' new game, uh, Mina the Hollower. I will absolutely be streaming that when it comes out. I just want to fight Metroids. And why are you playing a Metroid game, you dummy? Not too fond of Metroids. Kills them instantly. Oh, come the fuck on here. Y'all. I don't know who I'm speaking to and I- Fuck you.
Oh, Battle Network Collection is... Fuck! This room... And all it stands for... The, uh, the Battle Network Collection in... Well, I guess less than 24 hours now, digitally. It should be out by midnight tomorrow. I think, unless Capcom's gonna wait until 3 a.m., which will be hilarious. Won't matter for me, because I'm getting it physically, so... It won't be arriving until Friday, which is funny because I did a giveaway on Twitter and I bought a few copies for other people, and uh, all of them have shipped except mine. Mine ships tomorrow, and one of one of the winners is even probably getting it tomorrow rather than uh, Friday, and I'm just like, God damn, lucky. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna eek by guys here. It doesn't matter. You can't really hurt me anyway. I mean, it's just, you're just embarrassing yourselves. Yeah, no. Excuse me. I thought that wall was cr it is cracked, but like, I thought it was like, you know, cracked. Nah, we're good. We good. You got it. You got this. You're good. That leads down. That leads back down to where I was. Actually, you know what? This is the shortcut elevator. No, 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 actually. No, you know what? Yeah, no, because that leads to Fendrana Drifts. Let's take it. Now let me get the, uh, the lore, I think. No, Magmore Cavern South. So wait, what's the other elevator over here? Talon Overworld South. Okay, you know what? Never mind. This is still the right way to go. I just went in a big damn circle, didn't I? Well, I had to go the other way, but now I'm trying to get out of here, and I shouldn't have fell down, because now that procced a bunch of enemies I don't want procking me. I'm gonna head out. Bitch, give me a second. I'm gonna drink. Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, wow, getting over there rather than coming back from there is way more annoying.
Give me memories of climbing that Land's End in Mario RPG. Down here would be a nice place to hide something, but I suppose not. Okay, Magmore Caverns. We gotta find the artifact here. Lies within the tunnels of Magmore. Shadow the column at the column at the lake center to reveal the artifact of nature. Okay, so I gotta look for the for a lake. They always tell you exactly where it's located. Geothermal core. Plasma processing. Fiery shores. Monitor station. Warrior shrine. Shore tunnel. Triclops pit. Lava lake. Here we go. So we have to head to, uh... We have to head all the way to the other end of here. Thankfully, going perpendicular through this place isn't too bad. It's just climbing that one tower. That's a real pain to get to Fendrana Drifts. Which isn't much of a pain anymore. It just was... rush my way over there. So there is under lava sections, apparently. There's gotta be something here, but, like, you don't get an ability... I really never scan that. Hello, let me, let me 
jump, please. Thank you. Yeah, that fi those fire jets just really, really fuck you. There's probably an upgrade here I'm missing. We're at the lava lake, so there's a pillar that I could collapse in here. This one? Oh, it might not be this one. There it is. Eighth of twelve. We did it. We finished the time gear. And now we could stop uh, Dusk Noir. Is there something over here? No. Oh, those do collapse though.
so we want to head to the magma cavern. Quickest way, or what magma pool? Quickest way to do that is just go down here and go around. This room we need to be ball to get through it. We need to make Samus ball. God, sorry. Oh, I'm paying for saying that too, because when I said sorry, like air, like stung the inside of my nose. You know when you like, you know when like you, you, like, laugh and milk comes out of your nose, or like whenever any kind of liquid squirts out of your nose, I got like a quick pain in my nose like that. That's such a distinct feeling. You know, this game fucking just drop me off a cliff, why don't you? Yeah, it turns out this is probably how you're supposed to go to this room. Chose a lore at the end there, and I never noticed it. Because it wasn't glowing, that's why. It's gotta be an upgrade in this room. This really feels like a room where there's like some sort of upgrade. This Bendesium wall has. Oh, I see. Power bomb expansion acquired. Nice. The power of our temple and the twelve artifacts has sealed an evil in the depths of this planet. However, the future is cloudy to us. A world of veils where dark apparitions flit in the shadows. Within this strange world, one image stands out in the mist, flickering through the landscape, wraith-like. It is a human, a lone figure shining in, in the toxic shadows. We Chozo do not know what it is. But our hearts swell with hope at the promise of that glowing light. We will place our faith in our shrine. We will be there when the light shines upon our land. So, I mean, it's assumed that all this was written down long before Samus was born and that they kind of just foresaw it happening. Enough of you guys. Piston tunnel. I want to see if there's an item hidden here because I, I don't know if there is or isn't. Oh, we're getting the Zelda trailer tomorrow. I completely forgot. We're getting the final trailer. So 
so there's not going to be a direct, which I guess at this point, you know, we're, we're less than a month out from the game. But uh, yeah, we're not getting a direct, we're just getting the final trailer, which I'm assuming is going to be the story trailer, since we've seen fuck all nothing of that story. I'm not waking up early to watch it. I'm just going to watch it when I get up. I just noticed that there's like a, a neat little like, like kind of ripple effect around. Does it, can you see it here? No, you can't. But like when you see Samus like standing there in the cutscenes, the suit has like, like a bubble wrap kind of thing around it. Interesting. Analysis of artifact temple complete. Return artifacts to gain access to impact crater. Return Chozo Artifacts. So we're just missing what? The one pirate thing. And all the Chozo lore. We're just missing some creatures here. Something after the Fission Metroid. And then a bunch of stuff after Omega Pirate. crater. Lager fog of tentacle. Impact crater, impact crater. Okay. Alright. We have not missed anything so far. This one missing enemy here is in the, f is in the final area that we go to. Research. We got all of them. Artifacts. We got all of it. So we just need the, the creatures at the end of the game and the pi one pirate data we're missing. And then I need to get the rest of the items as well. Which at this point, I, I don't know where else to look. Oh, well, maybe there's something where the, uh, the next lore is. Fendrana Drifts, uh... Magmore Cavern South. That's the quickest way to get over it. Well, no, maybe not. Either, either entrance to Mag- to, to it. Magmore Caverns West and South both have kind of an even entrance point. West and south, okay. Alright. East. But where's the quickest way over there?
Ramen drifts north, okay. Oh, wait a minute. No, 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 no. Let's go the other way, because that, that way is less painful than going to that annoying room, and also it gets me closer where I need to be. Like there's there's something hidden here. But I guess not. Live? What happened? Okay, let's go to the quarantine zone. You have to post homework online. Uh, I've only had to do that because remember, I, I went to college in, in like the mid 2000s, so the online submission stuff was only just starting to take off. The few, I didn't have to do it a lot, but the few times I had to do it were a pain in the ass. Because, you know. It was before the systems worked really well. They didn't. They weren't made properly. I remember my college email account being a mess. Because it ran off like an early version of Gmail. That was made for like, organizations and it wasn't good.
bitch. Still the worst enemy so far. How was work for you today, ass? Yes, it was. It's, it's, fuck. It's kind of always ass, honestly. Like, today was probably the one, the best day this week, and it still wasn't good. Oh, nothing that can really be done about it, unfortunately. this. Our initial tests exposing Talon 4's indigenous parasites to Phazon appear to be successful. Increases in strength, size, and aggressiveness are common in all test subjects. Those unforeseen evolutions like additional poison sacs within the abdomen and the appearance of a second ring of mandibles in several subjects. These creatures were chosen because of their resilience, and it appears possible that, given enough exposure to Phazon, they may one day be able to survive on any planet we transport them to. Our methods will have to be refined. We currently have a 100% extinction rate after the fourth infusion period, and most survivors of the third infusion stage are so violently un so violent and uncontrollable that they have been you have to be euthanized. Even still, we remain hopeful that further experimentation will result in success. All that travel just to get that. Which is all done. And then artifacts are all done. Perfect. So we're on track to getting a 100% scan. Now where's the last 15% of the items? Is there like any way to see where the items I missed are? Ending is a, ending is the change. Ending does change depending on item collection. Ugh. Time and scans have no effect on percentage. Only items do.
Logbook only affects gallery. Under 75%, it's just short ending. 75% of bug is the second best ending, and 100% gets you the best ending. So if I, so I get the second best ending right now. Chosen artifacts count as part of your pickup percentage. Okay. There's like no way of figuring this out. Forty nine missile expansions and four bomb expansions. So you have the ability to carry eight power bombs and two hundred and fifty missiles at the end. What are we at right now? 190. So I'm only missing two... Oh, sorry, 250 missiles. Never mind. So I'm missing a lot of missiles. Wow. That's 10. And then... Two, so I'm missing 12 missiles. That can't be right. No, that can't be right. Two to get to 200, and then another 50 is 10. Yeah, it's 12. And then there's two more power bomb upgrades. So there's 14 upgrades I still haven't gotten? Oh my god. Who knows where the fuck they are? I think, uh, I think. As much as I really don't want to drag this out longer, I think, uh, we might have to go item hunting. Because I want to get the best ending, and I want to 100% this on my first go. Since I've 100%ed every other Metroid game. Um, so what I'm gonna do. Uh, I'll get the rest of the I'll start looking for the rest of the items, but I'm going to uh, take a very short bathroom break here. Be right back. Ooh -ee. That certainly was a bathroom break. Okay, so we're gonna uh, we're gonna find the remaining items. I'm gonna use a guide because the fact that the game doesn't mark them on the map or anything isn't very great. Apparently, two doesn't either, which is kind of oh man, really. Kind of an oh man really moment, but whatever. We'll make do. Three does, but again, like why why remove that function from the Metroid game when when Super was already out at this point? many of these. And this fucking website is like one of those ones that has like ads everywhere. But I could just open reader mode and it gets rid of them. Magmore Caverns that I definitely did not get. And there's one in Fendrana as well. Oh, wait. That's where I am. <laughs> Wait a minute, I know Fendrana. That's, that's that place that I'm currently in. You guys are back already? No, no thanks. I think I'm done with you. 
gonna scoot past you. Actually, it's at McDonald's. Mm. I go for a, I could go for a McDonald's right now. One whole McDonald's, please. I could go for an M crib. A nice juicy M crib. Actually, to be honest, I'm not a huge fan of the McRib. It's okay. It, it's all right. Ruined courtyard. That's uh. That's the room I was just in. What's your go-to meal? A uh, double quarter pounder with cheese and a, um, a smoothie. with the McChicken. I usually don't go for chicken anywhere just because I eat so much chicken at home that I, I get sick of it. Directly across from the door at the ruined courtyard. Turn around and jump to the rooftop. What? Rooftop. This is the ruined courtyard, right? Yeah. Been in there already. It's that, maybe some fries and nuggets and an iced coffee. I'm not opposed to iced coffee, but eh, I, I I don't like ordering coffee from places. Don't blame me, but yeah, exactly. Players should make their way. Okay. Directly across from the door to the ruined courtyard. Oh. Oh, it's not in the ruined courtyard. It's in the ice ruins west. So it was literally in the room that I was in. I should pay more attention. on this roof that we can melt. What? Did I get it already? I know I got one in the other area. don't remember getting a power bomb here. Was it right here? Oh, looks like you shoot down. Right here? This makes no sense. Hold on.
pew pew pew, yeah. I don't I'm trying to make heads or tails of what this image is showing. Unless it's that roof over there. Yeah, here it is. They made it sound like it was like right next to the door. Alright, that puts me at seven, so there's only one more power bomb left. And then the rest are all missiles. There's 12 missiles I'm missing. Oh god. Magmore Caverns power bomb expansions. There's definitely I definitely didn't get that one that they're showing. So let me go back to West. In fact, I think that puts me this this puts me literally in the in the room I have to be in. I miss you two deers. Oh yeah, you saw deers when you were coming home today, right? When I go down to Nessie's, I see them. There's a lot of deer in New Jersey. Because of uh we just live near a lot of forest. So when we're, down, we're driving down the highway, we'll see them. Almost lost your shit on the bus. Uh -huh. These holes look like there'd be something in there. that theater rhythm. Feel that rhythm, buddy. So apparently there's one in here that requires me to do something. Oh, I have to go back to the artifact room. Never seen deer at the area and always wonder if the deer actually do go to the forest and cliffs here. Yeah. What the? Wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. Was that bridge no longer out? Hmm. You know, I might actually stop soon. It's already three. I didn't realize that. Even though I've only been going for two and a half. You know what? No. Because by three it'll be two forty. I'll go till three twenty. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna go late tonight though. Um, I'm gonna stop. And then what I'll do is tomorrow, what I might do is, uh, just do, like, a sweep through the entire game. Get the remaining upgrades, and then if I have time, I'll finish it. I originally wasn't gonna stream tomorrow. Like, I was thinking of just calling tomorrow off, because I don't want to start anything new. No, Samus, do not... This is the second time this week I've seen animals out and about. Last week was a bald eagle on the bus. I don't know, I think it was weird. Really? I see hawks where I, li where I live. Not a ton of bald eagles, but... 
Definitely Hawks. So this can be busted, apparently. Yeah. Bandesian portion of area is unstable. Man, imagine trying to remember that. Puts us at eight, right? That should be all of them. It doesn't tell you your maximum, which is the silly part. But yeah, I think that I think that puts us at eight because I used two, and I had seven before. Oh, look! And it sent us through one of the tunnels. All right, so, Talon Overworld West. At this point, it's literally just missiles. We have all the health, all the power bombs, all the lore, except for the enemies in the final area. We just need the remaining 12 missile upgrades, and we've got 100% of this game cleared. Cleared. So I'm gonna go back to the ship, and then I'm gonna, I guess, use a guide to kind of reveal where the remaining ones are. Again, I don't feel too you know, cheaty about it, just because the game literally does not tell you, and some of these upgrades are pretty well hidden. So I don't mind using a guide. There was one down here, I think I already grabbed, yeah, I already grabbed that a long time ago. My favorite meal, long time ago egg, which would be long egg egg. Good. I, 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 some people claim this is like the best one of the Prime series. I, I, again, I can't really judge it because it's the only Prime game I've played outside of, like, slightly under, like, a, maybe like a third of Hunters. There was something there, but nah. But, uh, I don't know. I have to see, because a lot of people say 2 is the best as well, so I'm assuming 2 refines a lot. And then 3 is the one that, like, everyone's kind of mixed on. nothing in here. I've been up there already. That's, uh, that's how you get the door that goes back to the upper part of the first room.
It's just that they're saying that the plant there is giving off radiation. You know, if it's just animals being animals or some sort of message, oh, Nessie would absolutely believe it to be a, a message of some sort. She believes seeing deer very good luck for her. A seagull took a shit on my arm once on my on my I think it was my 13th or 14th birthday. I think it was my 14th birthday. Not sure. And apparently that's lucky. All right, here we go. From the top, baby. Missile expansion one. Behind Samus' ship, players can enter with the morph ball upgrade. We've already done that one. I know we have. Also gone the other way here too. There's nothing there. Transport tunnel B that's under the bridge. I already know I got that one. Overgrown cavern. Where's that? the overgrown cavern. Oh, okay. It's over there. It's that one up there. Can I get there? They roll in through the overgrown cavern. Oh, I got that one already. I know that one. Forget crash site. Uh, embedded in a wall under the water. Got that one already. Biohazard containment. They're really going in like a weird direction here from the beginning. Okay, so they want me to go in the ship first. Root cave. Hold on. Root cave. Fan should activate the X-ray visor. Hidden missile. Okay, I got that one. Door at the top of the arbor chamber. Is the arbor chamber... Okay, see, so yeah, I got those two already. Great tree chamber. I don't know if I got the one in the great tree chamber. Alright, well, let's head to biohazard containment, and we'll figure it out from there. Yeah. We do what we must because we can. At least I'm getting three hours, of, three more hours of content out of this. Room so annoying. 
Samus, please. What, what are you doing? I don't know about you, but lately YouTube thumbnails have been pissing you off a lot because, God, they often look ridiculous and we all know why. Yeah, it's just the algorithm. They do be like that, unfortunately. It's just, it's just what it is. Like, there's really nothing you can do about it. It's what gets views nowadays. This old YouTube. Yeah, everyone does. The actual funny version of YouTube, yeah. Is there anything up there? I feel like there should be something up there, but... underwater. There's a lot of weird quirks that subvert, that get subverted from regular Metroid. I think I've said this before, but it kind of reminds me of the uh, Marine Tunnel from Pokemon Black and White 2. There's like a huge tunnel underneath here, and I keep feeling like there's something to like open it, but I don't think there is. Like right here. forward to not Nacho Night. Mm. I might skip getting lunch this Friday just because I know I'm going to be spending a lot of money to go visit Nessie this weekend. How's she doing? She's doing all right. I want to see something. Reactor core. Is there one in the reactor core? No, it doesn't look like it. I mean, that's the only thing left to get 
missiles at this point. So if there's none in the reactor core, then there's none in the reactor core. She's doing alright. She's using, um... She, she's still using a cane, just because she's not entirely sure that she should be walking normally yet. But she said she's feeling a lot better. It's just, um... She's waiting to be cleared at this point. Biohazard containment. up with this game, well, of a few, it's just that it's it's very, it can get very dark, and like switching these isn't always the best option, especially since you lose your mini-map when, when you don't have the main one up. Oh, I have the one in here. The one where you have to blow up the wall to get it. door, root cave. After obtaining the grapple beam, players should have the ability to climb within the root cave. Oh wait, no, that's the place I was just talking about. Arbor chamber. Top of the root cave. Life grove tunnel, got that one. Great tree chamber. Oh, I have the, I have that one too. Okay, you know what? Coming here was a complete waste of time. So, I'm gonna go ahead and re just reload the save. Killing the eel from Mario 64. Yeah, no, those can't be killed though, because I did save before I, I started doing this. So we have all of them here. There were there were nine upgrades here. So we'll move to the Chozo ruins next. I think I didn't save in the sunken area. Talon Overworld. God, that suit looks so good. I love it. It's funny because I remember at the beginning of the game, I was like, oh man, I love the retro, like, unpowered up suit. And now I'm just gushing over this one instead. Okay. I think this does include everything that we've done up to this point, right? Yes, okay. We This is everything. Alright, so let's head to Chozo Ruins next. I mean, there's gotta be a few in the earlier areas that I've missed. Because if I'm missing 12 upgrades for the missiles... Then, uh, yeah, we're, we're definitely, we definitely just overlooked stuff at the beginning.
Main plaza. Okay, so I already know I got that one. I got that one up there, and I got that one on the indent right over there. Yeah, up there. The suspension of the players use the grappling beam to get it. There's a missile expansion in the tree near the door leading to the ruins entrance. seems to be weakened due to cellular composition. And I've scanned that before, too. Wow. Unbelievable. Alright, well, there's the first of the 12. We're at 195. Nursery. That's the one, that's the indent one, right? Yeah, I got that already. Ruined Gallery. Uh, Tunnel? Yep. Tunnel dug into one of the... Okay, I got that one already. But there's another one in the Ruined Gallery... What? Wow. A little ridiculous here, huh? Don't care. Don't care. Yeah, Ruin Nursery, I got that one already, so it was over there. Samus, what are you doing? You got like caught on the edge. was I to know? And then the one over here I already got as well. Pretty sure. Yeah, I got this one already. The map room was over there, so we already got that. Ruined Shrine is next. Why, why ruin shrine? Like, because I know for a fact if you go around here, there's one in the vault that I got already. Ruin shrine is is the place back here. Yeah, I don't know why these are listed in such a weird order. said it is about three hours now so 
next time I pass by a save point, I'm gonna stop. I know I've probably gotten at least one in here. I don't know if there's more than one, though. Well, there is more than one. I don't know if I got both. A missile below the door that leads to totem access. What are you talking about? Oh, ruined gal. Oh, never mind. I'm looking at the wrong spot. Ruined shrine. Half pipe. One side players will find a tunnel. Yeah, the rest I know that. I've gotten that one already. Plays a server the walls of the arena will find the where they play. Well, okay. Morph ball tunnel. Ah. Dig good. And the one in the half pipe I already got. I already know that. Yeah, there was one in here. Nope. Alright, I'm gonna look I'm gonna look through that area over there and then I'm gonna call tonight. I, no, I, I've i had Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 1 and 2 on Switch since it came out, and I was going to stream it way back then. That was like two years ago almost, and it just never happened. I was too busy, and then also the all the Blizzard stuff happened around then, and I'm just like, oh, well, now I can't really stream it, huh? Vault. Yeah, I already got the one in the vault. Ruined found. Okay, you know what? I'm going to look specifically for Tower of Light. Meditation Chamber and Light Tower of Light Access. Watery Hall, Watery Hall, Burn Dome, Furnace, Dynamo, Dynamo, Crossway, Training Chamber Access. Okay. Nope, there's none here. Alright. I'm gonna hit a save point and then we're gonna we're gonna close it up for the night. I think I've got more than enough remaining here to take me a while, because I still gotta go through the rest of the areas and figure out which ones I'm missing. There's still nine missiles left I need to get. Really don't, really hate how those Chozo Ghosts respawn immediately. So we're not doing too bad. Obviously it's it's a pain because we gotta like scour every pickup point at, right now to like find what's missing, but... Uh, so we aren't done here yet. Because I have other stuff I want to search for, but I am going to... Ruined Shrine, Ruined Shrine, Vault we've gotten, Ruined Fountain is next, so where's the Ruined Fountain? Watery Hall.
Ruin Fountain. Okay, we got the one in there. We definitely got the one in there. Gathering Hall, we got that one. Watery Hall Access. I don't think we got that one. Alright, so I'll head over there because there's a save point. direction is that? Oh, fuck. Okay, it's, it's, it's through that other room up here. Really? Nothing indicating I could blow that up. Alright, I'm gonna go save now and we're gonna quit. We'll, we'll pick it up from here next time. Does that put us 97% logbook entries completed item completion at 91% perfect we're en route to get a hundred of both we got everything that's missable nothing that's not well no actually we got everything that's not missable too I don't know what I'm talking about again it's really where that pause is on select and not ma and map is on start but you know I played the whole game we'll, we'll figure out eventually but yeah, this was, a, this was a good stream. We accomplished quite a bit tonight. Uh, and this absolutely is going to be done next stream. We'll get the remaining missiles, finish the story, get the remaining scans, and then we'll go to the extras menu and take a look at all that fun stuff. And yeah, that should probably be a stream. So I'll come back. I, I don't know. It may not be tomorrow. I want it to be tomorrow, but I may have other stuff I have to do. We'll see. Friday, uh, again... Probably going to do a Battle Network collection stream and do like an overview of it. And then uh, I won't be here Saturday. Oh, right. Uh, I have to... I, I said I was going to do the charity stream this Sunday, too. I am going to try to do it. Here's the problem. I'm going to be coming home Sunday from where Nessie is, and that requires me to take the train. I don't know what time I'm going to be back to do that. So we'll see if I'm... No, that won't work either. Mm. I'll I'll try to make sure I'm back on Sunday in time to do it. I'll I'll find and I'm gonna I'm gonna pick out the charity for that uh, by the end of tomorrow, and that'll be all set up hopefully. Uh, but yeah, we'll we'll finish Mario and Luigi this weekend hopefully, and uh, yeah, next weekend or next week, um, probably go back to Kirby, finish that or try to. I don't know if I'll get through it. And then on Friday of next week, Advance Wars comes out, and I'll be starting that, and that'll be what I'm playing until I go on vacation. So yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be packed. So like es essentially from next week, from next Friday on, my streams are pretty much dictated for the next several months. And if you don't know about that, go and watch the uh, the schedule video I made or a stream segment I did a few weeks no, a few weeks a week ago. I can't get through a single sentence without making a mistake, can I? 
But yeah, uh, thank you so much for coming. I appreciate it. You know I always do. Uh, if you want to watch more streams, check out twitch.tv slash team slash wildabandon. Plenty of people streaming there right now. Uh, you all have a great evening, and I will most likely be back tomorrow. If not, I'll be back Friday, and we'll finish Metroid next time I play it. Good night. Okay, bye. Me?